all right guys welcome back to another video today we're going to be looking at wire fiber and the best route i think is good for lots of different reasons uh it may not be the best place for spawns of wire fiber but this route will give you around about six the 600 to a thousand uh wire fiber every time you do the route uh and it's virtually continuous uh uh, route um because you literally only have to wait one or two minutes for it to respawn when you've completed the 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 route so you don't have to wait too long between routes it's a really good efficient way and because this uh is in brightwood um you don't have to be a high level to do this either that's really good but anyway guys before we begin please remember to hit that like button and hit that subscribe button if you are new to the channel so let me show you where we are today so we are going to be starting our route by here and uh essentially what we're going to be doing is we're going to be going over here round here up here up here up around here up here around there and then back down to here again so we're basically going to do a circuit around the places so i uh, let me show you my inventory uh so i don't have any wire fiber on me at the moment i've just got fibers and i got silk threads and why do you need wire fiber well you need wire fiber for a, a number of different reasons if you want to get your harvesting up to 200 the quickest as soon as you can harvest wire fiber it gives a lot of xp so it's really good um and it's also used to make infused silk um which is a tier 5 cloth as you can see on my screen and um it's used to make uh higher tier clothing uh items in the outfit and station so it definitely is a worthwhile being able to uh to get being able to get lots of wire fiber it's used in lots of different places all right so let's get to the route so let's start collecting so what you're going to do is once you start here you're going to straight away see some wi-fi over there and that's the one that you want to pick first so you can see there's a uh, another one over there and there's another one in the background over there so what i do is i pick this one up first and what you kind of want with the wire fiber, it depends sort of what you're after with the wire fiber. If you're looking to level up your harvesting, you're going to want one that uh, you're going to want a sickle that's got um, prospectors luck on it, I believe. Uh, so you get extra, extra luck. So I have uh, this one here, which has um, horticulture discipline. Sorry, that's the one. And it gets 8.8% more harvesting experience. So that's the one that you're going to need um if you're gonna look to level up your harvesting if you're just looking for just the yield then obviously you just need harvested yield um i've also got discipline on this one as well um but i am looking for a, a better sickle um because i don't know i don't need the uh the discipline i don't need the experience perk anymore because i'm level 200 harvesting so um what you want to do is you just want to pick these three up and then we'll go to the next location and you get quite a lot per per one i mean obviously i got the extra lead uh extra uh the what am I about extra yield sorry um but even without yield uh you'd still get 50 60 uh, um wire fiber per uh per node so don't worry about the whole uh the perks thing if you don't have yield you'll still get a lot uh yield just helps get a lot anyway once you get those three you're gonna go east and you're just gonna head towards the trees over here obviously if you are low level doing this be careful of the wolves uh they don't really aggro onto me because i'm level 60 but they will aggro onto you if you get too close to them. Um, so if you're a low level and you go uh, near the wolves, they're probably going to aggro onto you quite easily. So as you can see here, guys, 
wire fiber right in front of us here just behind this tree and we got another one just behind the bush in front of us over there so we just want to uh collect these ones real quick and as you can see there's some more right over there so we're right next to the fort if you want to know where we are uh, i'll just put the map open for you uh so yeah you just want to run over here now and get these ones over here um and as i say you know there are other routes that you can use for wire fiber there's uh these uh lots of spawns in up in eden grove even scale as well uh there's um lots of uh lots of wire fiber there uh the reason why i like this route is because nothing really attacks you on this route and you can just do this route uh virtually in, uh infinite infinitely because um the respawns are quite quick anyway so once you've done that guys you want to head over here and the reason why you want to head over here is because up on that hill there you'll see some wire fiber you want to head over there and get that wire fiber Uh, it looks like one, but it's actually two here. Just kind of really close together. So there's two two wire fibers here. Um, again, be careful of those uh, those guys, those the corrupted there. If you are a low level, um, and once you've done that, guys, you want to then turn back on yourself, and you don't want to head up here the top of the sort of uh little area that we're in so again if you're low level just keep an eye on these guys if you're level 60 they won't really aggro onto you just don't go close to them you'd be okay i haven't had anything aggro onto me when doing this um yeah i tend to go around there then i come up here just to miss a lot of the mobs uh so yeah when you get here you're gonna see that there's a uh, four wire fiber nodes here it's uh one of the better spots on the route you just want to collect this up as you can see i've already got 519 wire fiber so you know we're already we're getting quite a lot Oop, didn't mean to get that bush so yeah this is uh this is a really good uh spot and now what you want to do guys is you want to head up to buy here and up on this route here you're going to see some more rock uh wire fiber up here there's uh another three or four nodes up here as well this is where you get the bulk of the wire fiber on this section here so you just want to come up here come up the little mountain here cliff edge and as you can see there's wire fiber there wire fiber there and there's some over the edge as well get full of those guys so yeah there's three there's four actually there's one over the, the back there near the path just gonna collect this real quick the reason why i'm collecting them guys is so i can show you exactly how much i'm gonna get on uh, each route um just so that you guys have a good idea on how much you're going to be collecting each time we run this um but uh i was doing this yesterday and honestly i was just i think i ended up with about three thousand wire fiber because i just continuously just ran this around this the only reason i stopped was because i ran out of inventory space um and it was it was just so good i was leveling up my weaving uh i got my weaving up to uh 169 which uh 
It's pretty good. I put up my uh, harvest in the other day to level 200. I had literally loads of silk and loads of um, and loads of fibers like on me. So I was just like, well, I've got to do something with this. So I decided to put up my weave in a bit. Anyway, once you've done that, guys, you want to head over to there and you want to head up here. I wouldn't try and jump up those rocks. I've already tried it. It's, there probably is a way up, but you can literally just run around the edge like this and get there. Uh, don't do what I did and spent like 10 minutes trying to jump up the cliff and then you literally just run up the edge. Uh, so yeah, once you're up here, it's just going to be a single lonely one up here. But as it's on the route, might as well grab it. So to show you where we are, you just want to pick this one up. Okay, and the next one's going to be over down here. So what I tend to do is I go around this rock, uh, this little rock, this little mountain here. Um, and we go around. Up on the uh, right hand side on the rocks there, you do have some silver. If you fancy mining some silver on the way. Um... Up to you if you wish to grab that silver or not. So anyway, we just want to run down here. As you can see, there's more silver there as well. So there's quite a lot of silver around here. So if you are after silver, then uh, find that on the way. So you're going to come down to this section here. Now this section here does have quite a lot of mobs in again if you're level 60 they shouldn't aggro on to you but if they do um yeah, they're pretty easy to kill if you're level 60 uh just stick to the edges if you don't want to get aggroed stick to the river and then come up uh and then this is where the fiber is you just want to pick that up now what we're going to do is we're going to be heading over to here so to get over there, what you're going to do is you're going to hug the cliff here. You don't want to get any creatures aggroed onto you. You're just going to hug the, uh, the, the cliff edge. Uh, and you're just going to run over here. Once you get here, you're going to turn right and you're going to cross the river here. But that's how you're going to avoid getting any aggro. But if you are a lower level, then they will aggro onto you easier. So... Um, yeah, you may, if you're a lower level following this guy, then you may still get attacked. Uh, be careful for that guy as well. He's a little creep walking around the, the woods. Um, there's some river press here that you can pick up if you want. Uh, but anyway, what we're here for is the wire fibers. So here we go. There's one and there's two, three here. And this concludes the end of the route. So once you've done these three, we're, getting, we're then going to circle back. And I'll show you how quickly they respawn. Um, you really don't have to wait long. Uh, uh, thing. It's not like the Star Metal route where you have to wait like 5-10 minutes for it to come back. The Wire Fiber honestly takes... is honestly pretty quick to respawn. Um, so anyway, you just want to collect these. And then we'll circle back. And as you can see, I've already got over a thousand wire fiber on this route. So that's just one. This is just one circuit we've done, right, on this route. And this video recording is only be going for 14 minutes. So, you know, you're going to get, you could get up, you could get 4K an hour. Easy. Easy. Uh, okay, so once you've done here, you want, they want to head back down to where we began, down there. Oop, that's not what my intention was. Uh, and because I've been talking, I've probably been doing it slower as well. So you could, yeah, see, so you you could get you could get at least for, uh, up to 4k, if not more, doing this run. So uh, it just depends. Uh, as I always say on these videos, guys, it does depend on your server. If there's other people doing it, obviously you're not going to get as much. 
and blah de blah de blah. So uh, just make sure that you know if there's other people doing it and you're expecting 4K, you're probably not going to get 4K because there's other people doing it. Um, I know, I know, I say that on every gathering video I do, but it some people assume that they're going to get like a high amount on every route, and unfortunately on high pop servers. You're just not going to see that. Um, uh, especially if you're playing at peak times. Or doing this at peak times, sorry. As you can see, there's iron around us. You know, you can pick up on the way as well. Um, some hemp there if you wanted some... Uh, Fiber. So we're just circling back now to where we began. And I'll show you guys. Uh, I won't stop the video or anything. We'll wait for them to respawn. And I'll show you how quickly they respawn. They are really, really quick. There's also some hemp here, guys, if you want to pick it up. It looks dead, I know, but it is actually hemp. It's just... Has a weird look in Brightwood. Everything's dead in Brightwood. Okay, so as you can see, nothing's respawned yet. So we'll just stand here for a bit and we'll just wait for stuff to respawn. It literally won't take long to see something pop up in a minute. So I'll just recap over the uh the route again just so you know. So you start off here. You start off here, you then go over here, pick them up in the trees, to send some more here. You're then gonna go over here. You're then going to go up here. You're then going to go up here and then there. Then you're going to go up there. Then you're going to go over there. Then you're going to go there. Then you circle back. And it's as easy as that. Uh, the route. So we'll see uh, when some start to respawn soon. It won't take long. Uh, sometimes they respawn in like a different order of what you've picked them up. So... The first one that we picked up may not be the one that respawns first, but we'll just hang around for a bit. Honestly, you don't have to wait long. Uh, it, it's probably going to be really slow now I'm waiting for it because, <laughs> because we're recording a video. But there we go, look. One of them's already respawned down there, look. Um, so already one has respawned there. Just wait for the other two to respawn. You literally don't have to wait long. You really don't. And uh, yeah, you can get quite a lot. I say I do recommend if you're doing it for uh, crafting to get yield as a perk on your sickle. Because that will really help you get a lot of uh, wire fiber. Um, so if you're doing it for crafting, definitely get yield. Um, I swear it is going slower now we're recording the video. <laughs> but it's fine. There's also uh, some cranberries here. We'll just pick these up. Two cranberries. Yeah, we picked up 1,099 on that one trip. So that was pretty good. That was pretty good. Um, no complaints about that. We'll just wait for the other two to respawn. Sorry, guys. I thought it. I thought we uh, they they would respawn slightly quicker than this. It did feel a lot quicker on stream. Uh, you honestly don't have to wait long. Honestly, I think it's. I think it feels longer because I'm like watching it. There we go. So there, there we go. There's our first one respawned again. So there we go. That wasn't that long, was it? Um. And then that one down there will respawn in a second. So. That's the uh, the wire fiber route, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. 
Uh, please hit that like button if you enjoyed it. And uh, good luck fi farming wire fiber. Uh, there's quite a lot of it around in the world. Um, but honestly, this route is probably my favorite because you don't have to worry about things attacking you so much. Uh, it's just a good chill route to do. Um, but yeah, enjoy the route, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye.